So good afternoon, YouTube. Might be a little loud. Um, Lord's had me pull over on the side of the road. I want to talk to you a minute about witnessing. Check it out. We're on the side of the highway. So what? What it says in Revelation is that he was overcome. Now he he is Satan. Okay. Let's just establish who he is. He was overcome by the blood of the Lamb and the word of their testimony. So the testimony is the witnessing. Now, yeah, I made a video earlier this week about how I used to pray and 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 how I kind of changed things up a little bit. And you know, the point is, is that three times this week, three times the Lord has used me. Uh, to witness. I mean, it was Wednesday. I'm down in a manhole at the University of Missouri on Wednesday. You know, I'm freaking new pipes coming in. I'm sitting here and I'm, I'm doing my thing and, and, you know, doing some welding inspections and stuff. And the guy I'm talking to, you know, I mean, he's about to cry. I'm about to cry. Just talking about the things that the Lord's done and what he's seen us through and then just how awesome he is. And then today, you know, the same thing happened with this, uh, it's a wonderful person that I work with. I won't say her name, but she's just, uh, she loves God, but she knows that she's still sinning and everything. I'd give her a book because we had a little bit of downtime, you know, one of those uh, precious testimony books. And uh, I saw her over there reading it. And she come back, she says, George, <laughs> she says, she's out, she says, I read those stories and it's just like, you know, they was made just for me. You know, my life is, is exactly that, 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 you know, kind in a lot of those stories. And I told her, I said, well, you know, I said, I said that's, I, I guess that's why God had me give it to you, you know? And I sit there and talk to her about Jesus and how much he loves her. You know what, what I got to do is I've got, I've, I've got so many missed opportunities that I could have been praying with people, praying for people, but you know, I'm, I'm still growing still growing in the Lord and the praying thing you know sometimes sometimes when I don't know what to say or I don't even know what I'm supposed to say you know in prayer and I really want to say something I just I just holler out to Jesus 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 I sit there for 20 minutes just holler out to Jesus because I know that he hears me but, but I got to get to the point to where I can pray for people and help save people and then and bring him to the Lord, you know. I know that I'm helping people. I know that I'm bringing people to the Lord. But my next step is praying for people, praying with people. I want to learn to be a prayer warrior, you know. And uh, anyways, I just encourage you to, to truly seek the Lord and let him use you. Let him use you. He loves you so much. And, you know, if you're not going to work for Jesus, who else are you going to work for? If you, he needs your help. He's recruiting recruiters. He needs more fishermen. Myself, I'm going to be a fisher of men. One little, one little jewel at a time. I'm going to store that stuff up in heaven. I love you all. I hope that you get the meaning of what I'm saying. I hope that it touches you in a special kind of way. I hope that you're blessed by the message. God bless you. God loves you. Jesus loves you. I love you. And I hope you have a wonderful, awesome day. Cross Country Mission. Oh, I'm going to have my cross tomorrow. I left it down at my house in, uh, where I live last week. I've been missing it all week long. I'm going to go carry it in the morning. Anyways. I love you guys. Uh, Cross Country Mission, I'm out. Have a, have a great and awesome day.